Hey guys, welcome back to the Destiny 2 Witch Queen. And, uh, I got my lip a little bit more to scratch. It's not above it like I was before. But it is taking forever because I'm trying I'm trying to avoid strikes. And I'm only doing public events and it's taking forever. So for the sake of getting progress done, I'm going to go with this light. It should be enough to kill the enemies. I know I can get more light while in the mission. So it should be fine. Okay, so as we're going back into uh, the the nice fortress, which has been it's been a while since we were in here. Ow! Okay. So let's go for last chance. That doesn't sound ominous. So apparently, um, Marasov, the Queen of the Awakens, might be appearing some point in this uh, DLC. Though when, I have no clue. We're in position. Where are we headed? Your destination lies deep within the fortress, Guardian, in the Apothecary Wing. There you should find a particular shard of crystal. You might recognize it from Savathun's time in the custody of the Awoken. So this huh. crystal is a piece of her former prison, which means it was likely on her when she stole the light. Yes. My source uh -huh. believes the events leading to her escape are intrinsically linked to the mystery before us now. This crystal could very well be the clue we've been looking for. Oh, so is this hum... Yes. This person, Sabathun's the queen? halls are just as winding and deceitful as her mind. To move forward, you must seek out the more aberrant paths. That's why we have in, uh, some variety in who's talking to us during the missions. That's nice. Um, my men to attack this. Reveal. Oh. Uh, A sneaky. I see. Eris, what's the situation? The guardian is en route to the object in question now, Commander. Good. Sure, this will get us the answers we need. We can't afford another dead end. The Queen of the Reef does not share information lightly. Yeah, Marisol with the Queen. Gave you the tip. You didn't mention that before. I <laughs> did, in fact, mention it to Ikora moments before you interrupted us. She agreed there was no more reliable source on this matter than Savathun's former captor. I trust Mara. But she plays her cards too close to her chest. If she had shared this earlier, we wouldn't be so desperate now. Hmm. To win against the hive god of cunning and lies, it's best not to show one's hand too early. I bet this hive sword will be just as useful as the last one. Now we need to find a lock to smash Ow. Yep, I agree with you, Ghost. Because I see the... Lucent Brood uh, gunk there. Okay. Okay. Where am I jumping? This way. Queen may have recast her realm in a loosened sheen, but remnants of dark architecture still lurk underneath. And the Guardian's hmm. new ability reveals these hidden remnants. Yes, Ikora explained. Why can't we use the light to achieve the same result? The light hmm. may be a powerful force. But when dealing in illusions, it has proven insufficient. It is the mind that must bend to see the truths hidden here. Thus, only darkness can show the way. My only fear is where that way will lead us in the end. 
So it seems like Ikor is a little bit more trusting of the dark, or at least the the inter like the darkness as its ability, while she doesn't trust the entity behind it like everyone else. And while Zavala is completely no 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 darkness all bad, <laughs> what it seems. I like how this can hit multiple enemies at once. Okay, there we go. Okay, this looks like an area where we have to fight a lot of enemies. Which is good, because by the end of it, that should give me some loot. I don't like this ogre. This ogre's gonna go first. Okay. Why am I whacking? Um. Wait, where? Oh, well, there it's there. Okay. There we go. Okay, reload this because I need the ammo. It's a bit annoying that I ran away as I threw this grenade at it. Okay, well there's a hive guardian there, so probably help if I put a bubble here. Keep staying in here. There we go, that works. Okay, go get out of here. Gotta go out of there. Get to that ghost. Get to that ghost. There we go. There we go. Not as easy as I thought it was going to be. Okay. Um. Alright, so I'm going to fuse that in. Because basically what I'm doing is I'm fusing all weapons, but armor I don't really care about. I can just plop whatever that I, armor I get on. Okay. Boosts up my light a little bit. You've done well honing the gift granted to you by the Black Fleet, Guardian. Do you see now, Commander, why Ikora chose as she did? For all her doubts, she knew only darkness, channeled by a strong mind, could bring us this far. I understand. My issue isn't with the call Ikora made, but the fact that she made it on her own. We know how Savathun operates. She singles people out for a reason. There's no need to make her job any easier. Hmm. Paris. I think you know better than anyone that darkness is not a path to be forged alone. She wasn't alone. Though, I take your point. Okay. At least there was another flying area here. And uh -huh. aha. Okay, so if there's a sword around you, then I know where that goes. Okay, come on. Shoot. There we go. There we go. Okay. 
I'm stunned for the pain. For why no more reliably. Get back here. Okay. Come on. There we go. Now let's go up to go to the other side and do what I've already done here. Yep. Have a sword. The other side. Okay. I didn't expect to lose that much health for that fast. And the weapon okay to just be gone. Okay. I think I've got a, a strategy in my head. I need to clear out these guys first. Okay. back. Please destroy this. Come on. There we go. That was a bit risky. I will admit. Okay. Now if I can get at least over here. actually make it. That's the the worry. Okay. Can't risk it too much. Two boots. I got that boot. I got that boot. I need for that boot. I go for that as well. Okay, good. Looks look. This looks a bit like the entrance to the Scarlet Keep in a little bit. This is definitely the apothecary wing. Somehow, it feels even creepier in here. Naturally. You're trespassing on the testing grounds for the Lucent Hive's most wretched experiments. Right. Yeah. 
Holy moly. Must have been a build up of moths there. Not a, a sentence I would thought I'd ever use in my life beforehand. Right, okay, so there's a sword needed here. Savathun likely appointed one of her high council wizards to keep watch over this place. Find them. The crystal is sure to be nearby. There we go. I said one. There's two, and none of them were the actual high council wizard. Okay, now there's an ogre down here. There we go. Ah, loose the sword. Do I still the sword? Good. Okay, nearly just launched myself off the edge. That would have been very much unfun. Okay. No signs of a crystal so far. Just rows and rows of jars filled with. Is that light? But it's tainted somehow. Savathun has always encouraged her wizards to push boundaries of hive magic. It seems that hasn't changed with the night. Proof, perhaps, huh. that corruption has far less to do with the power than the one channeling it. Or the power has permanent side effects. Darkness transforms Sabathun into kin for prey to predators. Not darkness itself, but an entity behind it corrupted the hive. Conditioned their power on an endless blood tide. Their fate is not inevitable. I have no doubt that some can handle darkness with discipline. But those who can't, they're not the only ones to pay the price. <laughs> I mean, these are all making good points. Okay, there's a C thing over here. Okay. Right. So we'll go through here. Okay. Is an inverted realm. Explore any and all directions, especially those you least suspect. Uh huh. Okay, so it's another battle area. Looks like we're interrupting something. Where's the wizard overseeing all this? Um. There. We just found the one in charge around here. Good. Now go and beat the whereabouts of the crystal out of them. The wizard just fled. Follow them. They're closing ranks around the crystal. Okay. Hello. By the way, this wizard looks a bit like the the wizard from the end of a uh, uh, Shadow Throne. Which technically that was one of Safoon's wizards. So, was it or was it her daughter? One or two. Okay, quickly 
you take care of this knight before there's any super stuff. There's the crystal guardian. Time to finish this. Okay. There we go. Oh wait. This isn't respawn. There we go. Ow. Ow. Okay. Pick up. There we go. We've come a long far for this. Inspires bravery. Bravery inspires sacrifice. And sacrifice. That was Sabathun, all right. But what does that mean? Hmm. This is the evidence we've been seeking all along. Ikora's instincts were correct, after all. Indeed. But we don't have our answers yet. Go unlock the memory, Guardian. Then let's see if this cracks the case. Okay, so it looks like she was saying the same lines which, um... The speaker said to Gol back in the uh, vanilla story for Destiny 2, which is bravery leads to sacrifice, sacrifice leads to death, I'm pretty sure. Oh, it was everything was sung along those lines, but yeah. It's basically how you become a garden if you like match that criteria, you uh you get resurrected basically. Okay. My level's been boosted quite a bit there. Okay, so okay, please don't get me out there. I feel like we're getting edging closer and closer to the end of this DLC, or at least the story side. There seems to be a lot more content, but this is definitely one of the longer, if not the longest, campaign for a DLC. Easily. There's a chest here. Won't mind if I do. That gave me a chest plate. Ooh, 150. Right, one, oh, 1500. Which I believe that's the, the, the soft cap, I'm pretty sure. And if that's the soft cap, I'm pretty sure the light it's not the the level's not gonna go anywhere higher than that in terms of mission levels. So I feel like we're nearing the end in that respect. I just wanna know what happens at the closing part of Sophoon, because I, I kinda want her to be killed off. But uh it's kinda normally what happens. <laughs> and it's a DOC dedicated to them. Highest level three, obviously. Okay. So where am I? Here. Okay. Like def this place definitely reminds me a little bit like um the dreadnought. Well, also keeping itself new, which is uh, something I like because I like, like I said uh, before, the general was my favorite area in Destiny history. So I do like those, like some kind of like hints of it here and there, but it's still its own thing. It would be nice to come back to the Dreadnought like eventually in Destiny 2, even if it's like a one mission. It would be still pretty cool. Okay. I believe we're approaching pretty soon. I 
Hopefully it won't reject us this time. We'll actually get some answers. But I suppose the one reliable way to get past a trickster is just look in the trickster's memories, I suppose. Okay. Access altar. Is it going to push me back? No. Good. Okay. So now we're in the altar of memories, or whatever it's called. Auto reflection. I've read some of Ikora's notes on the darkness and the light, Guardian. She thinks the darkness is closely linked with memory. Uh -huh. You access this place with the darkness power. What exactly have we tapped into here? Yeah. So let's spot the difference. So that's what's going to be there. Okay. So it looks like that's a difference. Okay. Um. Okay, so I messed that up. Okay, so it's you. Um. You. And then a you. There we go. Uh -huh. Oh, there's more? Oh. Okay, well, you. No, okay, it's not that. But that means that's the odd one out then. Okay. Um. I've got a sense for the pa what the pattern should be. It should be that. But I'm not seeing any differences. Oh, there we go. Um, there we go. And then... There we go. Open a sesame. Let's get this new memory. Can see the crown there again. Okay. Oh. Memory Keeper. He's new. But not particularly hard, boss. So that was Zirash, which I'm not sure that was from Zav like Zebra or Raf was a um, younger, or is it just a similar name? I'm not sure. But I thought I just point that out just in case that is a thing. Put himself a healing rift. Interesting. Okay. Right, okay. It's always the moths that get me. But luckily none of this is always happening in actual zones where I have to respawn, like, the whole thing. Okay. Saifun is again staring at 
perfectly at us. View memory. So what? Are we getting a cutscene? Ah, oh, okay. on earth huh hello old friend ah. i've chased you for a long time first as an enemy then as a collector and finally now a supplicant what is it the guardians say devotion inspires bravery Bravery inspires sacrifice, and sacrifice. She seems humble, but here we are. Might be a trickster. So she actually died. So she actually died after that. She seemed humble there, but that might have been just because she was dying and also she was trying to trick the traveller. And there's a ghost. There we go. That's how she got the light. Hmm. That show is now looking. Yep. Incredible that I could forget something like that, isn't it? Such a storied life, erased. The light offers us a fresh start, but if we don't know where we came from, how will we know where to go? Hmm. I'm so grateful to you for reminding me, for telling my story. Wait. What is she talking about? She remembers. <laughs> we helped her remember. Thanks for the memories, Guardian. Yep. I knew it was a trick. We have to leave. Okay. So yeah, I I knew she was staring, like she was like hovering above. So like she had to be staring, but now she remembers. So she didn't remember the whole time. Wow. I knew Ikora had nothing to do with Savathun having the light. But the truth is so much worse. I don't understand how the Traveler could choose her the same way it chose you. 
We need to talk to Zavala. Hmm. But it is interesting to see that she actually did die after the like the the ritual that happened in the end of the season of the Lost. She did die. Like as soon as she got teleported, she gave us Osiris and said thank you and then went to Earth and then died. Wow. Oh, it would be really interesting, though, is if we find out our past, just like how she's found out her past in the steel seat. That would be cool. But, uh... So, I look, from the looks of it, it looked like it was happening where she died, at least. So, while everyone was just playing around in the tower, Saifun was in those mountains over there, dead. Yeah, it had to be over there, because it, it, you can kind of see there's loads of mountains there. Wow. Now that's... Now I didn't expect that. I thought she like kind of survived and then got a ghost that way. Checking now. But no. Transfer. She, she genuinely just died. <laughs> we all have to look out for each other. Okay, let's go into Zavala's office, which is below me, not here. Let's see what joins a vanguard meeting. Okay, let's see what happens. Everyone's here. Wow. So, you're saying Sabathun was dead? Our most devious adversary, the one who nearly decimated the last city from within, was dead. And the Traveler resurrected her? Yeah. I wouldn't have believed it either, but... But why would she need us to recover her memories if she never lost them in the first place? This has to be another trick. Hmm. A lie to fool us into surrendering the traveler without a fight. This has been the traveler's approach from the beginning. The Books of Sorrow detail many civilizations it blessed with the light, then abandoned. High propaganda. The Fallen tell the same story. When the Witness and its Black Fleet came to call, the Traveler moved on to our system. Where it sacrificed itself to save humanity from the same forces. Forces which included the Hive! Hmm. After all that, why would the Traveler give our worst enemy the light? Hmm. It doesn't matter. I don't know why the Traveler gave Sabathun the light. Maybe it has changed its mind about Guardians. Maybe it's not as infallible as we once believed. I don't know, and it doesn't matter. <laughs> because I'm here to protect humanity. And if Sabathun takes the Traveler, we lose our light, along with any hope for surviving the Witness's return. So, whatever it takes to stop this heist, we will do. All right. How do we stop this? Ooh. I'm not sure yet, but I know where to find out. She just gave us a dead worm. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
It is an interesting proposition though that crap I just dropped the controller. But like the the biggest enemy that we faced, she was dead and then the traveller resurrected her. That is an interesting prospect. That literally all the troubles, all the fighting, everything had stopped. And then she was resurrected. Okay. Hive legend tells us Sabathun was born on a far off planet where she would have lived an uneventful life if it weren't for her worm familiar. Hmm. The object you retrieved from the underbelly of the throne world. What if it's not a statue? What if it's the worm familiar itself, calcified from age? Hmm. That would explain why you couldn't unlock it with the others. That also means it contains a memory that Sabathun herself doesn't know. Hmm. What that is, we're going to find out. With the one tool we have capable of slicing deep into the past. It'll be risky using the relic this way. Oh. Which is why I'll be taking this on myself. What? Eris will help me prepare. Meet us on Mars when you're ready. Huh? This is how we stop Sabathun Guardian. I know it. So it's interesting that this is still what we needed the worm for. Oh, and this is how we get... Ah, okay. So it grenades. Ah, okay. So I can get the scare grenade. Vaccine bolt. Vortex. I'll try the scare grenade. Why not? Meditate new class. Carry the light with you. Meditate. Okay. Uh grenades. Sky grenade. Okay. We'll crush these would be saviors together, Guardian. Okay. Let's go to the enclave then. So what will we possibly find out that Seraphun doesn't know about her past? Like, very far in her past, clearly. Okay, it's the starting. Oh. Okay. That's worrying. Shouldn't we be here as well? Just make sure this this works. Yeah, the statue's doing a crazy. Actually going to fundament. These frail siblings will soon be claimed by the light. Unless we claim them first, huh. we will tell the most cunning sibling of cataclysm, a prophecy of great loss. We will feed her fear, her pride. We will say, Young Sathona. Like a bit like Anakin Skywalker, in a way. Like the darkness glinting before the light could. They were tricked. The hive were lied to. Okay, I'm not sure how that was much more of a, a big surprise. But uh wow. That does uproot some logic there. 
that they were lied to the entire time. That there was not even like some truth behind it. Still so, you know, like, still feel like I should have been there for like support, because we're the guardian. But sure. So, the hive god of lies was lied to. This changes everything. It does. Well, not everything. We still can't let Savathun seal the Traveler away. The ritual's already begun. We need to move fast. Okay. Savathun may be one of the Traveler's chosen by rights, but she's still leaning on tricks she learned from the Witness. Take the familiar to Savathun's fortress. I'll follow as soon as I'm recovered. Wait until you're in the heart of the ritual. Then unleash the memory. That should okay. be enough to destabilize things and break her hold on the traveler. Remember, Guardian, Savathun's strategy rests on knowing more than anyone else, on her ability to twist lies and cast confusion. But now, we can turn the tables on her. Huh. I'm not sure what this is going to do, but. Come back soon. This might be the last mission. Um, so where is this? You have questions? So what do I do? The Vanguard will survive this. The ritual the mission, is it here? Will survive this. It's not. Okay. Where do I go? It's there, okay. Ritual. Okay, 150. This seems to be the last mission. Okay, let's see what happens. So we're going to show her that they were lied to and what? Is this going to stop her ritual? Is it going to make her see that she was lied to? I, I don't see how this is going to go. But it does show that the, the hive once could have been chosen by the light. If the darkness didn't interfere. The traveler, Ikora. The traveler is already here. I think we're too late. We are in the domain of the god of cunning. Things are never what they seem. Hmm. It's not too late. I can feel it. Right. Now that the Traveler sees what Savathun is doing, why won't it take the light away from her? Why is it just letting this happen? I don't know why. We may never know. But we know what we need to do to protect the last city. Stop mm -hmm. the ritual. Protect our connection to the light. Humanity needs you. Both of you. Scorn our that explains why that building ship like that, because it's like a cradle. The Hive are summoning heavy reinforcements from the portal. That will block our route into the fortress. Hold off the hive and the scorn as long as you can, and leave the portal to me. I'm on my way. Okay. Okay, quickly destroy that ghost. Okay, yeah, come on. Okay. That abomination is going to be a bit of an issue. So let's not make it an issue. There we go. Spawn. I have a, I've got it. There we go. Go on. I'll 
don't draw fire here. All that matters right now is the trap. Whatever you hear, whatever you see, don't let it distract you from stopping the ritual. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Cause of throw thorns. The are arriving by the hundreds. The ritual must be growing stronger. Remember the plan. Clearly, Martin. stop the ritual by whatever means necessary. Without the light, the last city is defenseless. Okay. okay come on. That was a bit risky there, but it's for the goddamn traveller, man. I do like the high stakes in this, though. Normally, they, like the DLC is kind of being enclosed to a certain event. This has actual consequence, like right now, right here, like right here now. That makes more sense. The ritual is happening at the top of the fortress. We need to find a way up. Okay. 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 There we go. Hopefully swap helmets. Get that smidge of more light on. All the more helps. So where's the queen actually come to this? Because it showed that the queen was on the trailer. But here she uh, hasn't really shown. She was mentioned by words, but not here. Okay. So what do I do? That's clearly something I'm going to bring over there. Right, there's symbols. What, what, what are these supposed to mean? Oh. Hopefully that wasn't important. Like what happened? Like there's not like a puzzle. I have to follow that exact order. Okay. Just gonna. Play, okay, not play it safe, I'm going to reload. There we go. Okay, come on. Come on. Oh, come on. There we go. Yeah, it's ogre down there. All right. Okay, well that just happened. Um OK. 
Okay. There we go. Where am I going? This way? This way. Okay, you know what? Just rock it, rock it, rock it. Okay, it's gone. Good. Okay, psst, please, stop reeling under when I actually need it. Okay. Okay. Okay, so it looks like there's crystals on the other side as well. I'm gonna risk that jump. Okay, there we go, finish him. Boom. Bappity bap pow. Okay. What about that? Oh, good damn it, that crystal built above me. Um. Haha. Uh -huh. Yeah, very funny. Nice joke. Um. I feel like I'm gonna need to go through that portal. <laughs> I'm not sure why there's runes above it, which is worrying me still, but hopefully it's just because they're there. <laughs> right. the way I need to go. Hmm. There's the crystals on the other side. Right. Somehow I'm going to need to get up there though. I can shoot that? Oh, I can't. Uh, I'm just gonna bite the bullet. <laughs> nope. It's very funny, Safoon. Okay, am I on the second floor? I believe I am. Good. Now I can finally take care of the enemies up here. Where where's the street where I can hear? I was there, okay. There we go. Um, okay. Um, that's supposed to do something? <laughs> Other than getting Seraphim to laugh at me? Um, I wouldn't be like if I said I knew what to do. The main noise when I destroyed all the crystals. 
but I still haven't got an orb weather, so I can't. Hmm. I think I'm just going to have to try an arrow of gates. You have to tell me that she's laughing. I can hear her. Okay, so I need to look for Vex Head, Paris, and Paper. Uh, no. No. It's close. Uh, Vex Head, Paris. No, that's explosion. Ah, damn it. Wrong order. There we go. Ah ha I did a smart. Okay, so now I'll do, just go for the other one. Which is... Paper, paper, vexad. That's easy to remember. Okay, so paper, paper, vexad. Oh, there. Oh, easy. <laughs> there we go. Okay, where was that curse for? Okay, I'm not going to get there in time. Oh, that's good. Whew. All that for just one light-bearing hive. Where's my chest? <laughs> is that up here? It is. Good. Okay. I'll save it because actually that's in time progress. I know so it only upgrades by one, so there's no point in using it. So did I get any armor? Got boots, nice. Okay. You just stop this ritual by going on to the. Oh, this is the left, okay. Surprise. Uh -huh. oh, I'm joking. This throne world is indistinguishable from my own mind, Guardian. Every step taken, every bullet fired, every thought whispered. I keep and count them all. Remember that. We well, clearly don't remember something. Okay. There we go. Okay, well... I'm not sure... Okay, that's what I was meant to do. Okay. Um I was going to say <laughs> Okay, we're at the top with this massive bell. 
I'm so glad you're here to see this. <laughs> yeah. I'm glad too. Okay, so what do I do? What do I do? Do I just fire? I can do that. Oh, okay. This is a little too easy, uh, don't you think? This is a bit like uh, in the first mission. There we go. Okay. Use the scythe, please. Oh, the glaive. Okay. Yep, there's supers. Okay, so I'm assuming there was one of each, so there's a wizard and a hunter somewhere. Bow. Wizard! Okay, so where's the hunter? The hunter's there. Got one shot left. Will that be enough? No. Oh, Christ. Um... Okay, so now I'll go over here. Oh, Seraphoon. There we go. That was a little too easy, but there's her ghost. Okay. It's gonna get resurrected. <laughs> That's much for sure. Can I do the thing I was sent here to do? Pursue Sarfoon. Little ghost, you were asked to accept the darkness. Asked to turn against your cousins. Asked to defy the will of the Traveler. My ghosts make no concessions. We serve the Traveler's true interests. No well, concessions? How stupid do you think I am? You and your siblings. You killed my friends. I remember Clona and the Great Disaster. I remember Oryx and the Taken. I remember what you did to the Awoken and the Dreaming City. I'll never forget what happened to Sagira, to Osiris. Oh yeah. I would die before I ever chose to help the Hive. That is very much true. She's watching. Defeat Seraphoon's illusion. Okay, well, she's got the powers, but also, fires on where? Yeah, it's not a darkness zone. But I'm not doing much damage. Um, it says I'm doing damage, but I'm not doing that much damage. She's 
too powerful. What do we do? Yeah. We have to reactivate that portal to access the memory altar. Showing her the truth won't stop her, but we need to try. Yeah. Okay, so what do I do? Um I don't know what to do. Where's the portal thing? Where I'm gonna go. I d uh, There's Kermes? I must go kill enemies until it becomes a power to me. throwing a lot of powers around but I'm not too worried because it's still not a dark zone yet apparently I'm going to reopen the altar but I don't know where or how Oh, here. Oh. How am I gonna... Oh wait, these are projections. Am I meant to kill the projections and then they drop something? If that's the case, then I'm, I'm a dumb. Storm trance, okay. Yeah. Now it's clear. Now it's clear what I'm supposed to do. Glass breaker. Yes, what ritual? So we have to do it again. Okay. Let's go with the glaive. It's pretty powerful. Glass breaker times two. The sword ritual. The portal's open. Okay. Oh, wow. This is a spell. Sabathun is spinning a web around the Traveler. We have to free it. The tethers are coming from those towers. Find a way to reach them. Through the portals. Ah, makes sense. Okay. What do you think you're going to do? You can't stop this. I know it goes against your nature, but you can still lose gracefully. Okay. Well, I'm in your, I'm in your system, messing with your shit. Her the memory guardian. Okay, show memory. These frail siblings will soon be claimed by the light. Unless we claim them first. Hmm. How did you? We will tell the most cunning sailing of the cataclysm. A prophecy. Good enough. No. No, that's not what happened. The traveler never came to us. We were forced to choose the deep. How could I have missed this? 
So now you want to play games. Oh, okay. Then let's play. She was thinking, but now she thinks this is a trick. Um, what do I do? Guess we'll have to do that again. Okay. She's too powerful, so we're gonna have to wait for her projections to pop out. Spawn your projections, please. That'd be very nice. Okay. So was this something that before she died she knew about, but then she died and then she forgot it? Or did she just never know in the first place? That's my question. And that's why she died kind of accepting in a way, because she knew she was lied to? I'm not sure. Doing damage. There we go, now she's immune. Which th this should allow her to spawn her projections, which is what I need. Well, there we go, we can just go in. Okay. The spell's almost broken. Oh. Right, okay. Got a bit of a jumping puzzle now. Okay. I'm fine with that. How do I... It's a little high up, don't you think? Oh, okay. Please just use the glaive. There we go. So you're the expert now. The expert on me. On the high. Oh. On trickery. She's getting Is a bit angry. Really We're angering the witch queen with tricks and deceit. Okay. There's two more to go. Okay. There we go. one. Okay. 
There we go. Now we get to show her the trick one last time, or is the spell just broken? Or oh, what's happening? Okay. Come on. There we go. Showing it to her again, apparently. Or the rest of it. We will feed her fear. Her pride. Okay. There's no more threads to break. Okay. I think all you done was anger her. So I feel much going. Where is she? Oh. Okay. Her support first. Her support? Her way now? When, it, when they say support, they just mean like the enemies around. Web weaver there. Or Fred Weaver. So I'm assuming it's the Fred Weavers I need to get rid of. Okay. Okay, stop hiding. Oh, come on! Oh, I hate Thrall! Ugh. I hate Thrall, I hate Thrall! Where's the Fred Weaver? There it is. Take out her support first. I'll leave that one to last. Okay. Okay. Where is Safri? Let's just there. Okay. Basically, like find a high version of gold. Okay, that's probably the most damage you can get in for now, so I'm gonna play it safe and drop out. Okay. Okay, 
come on. Okay, I'm gonna do up here again last. Because I'm not, I don't think it really matters because I haven't got my super, but that little bit may help. As I'm got heavy, so hopefully I get heavy from this wizard here. Okay. Okay. Keep forgetting that this pack's a punch. Oh, come on! Ugh. Just literally out of nowhere. Oh. <laughs> okay. I think for now I'm going to say screw... Screw uh, that for now and let's try this. If it doesn't work, I could always go back. But I think I just need that extra damage to push me over. Focus on those wizards. Please melee them. Okay. Okay. Let's hurry on me here, so just because I need that. Okay. Please, because that did nothing basically. Right, my my rock launcher does a lot of damage. Right, I'm beginning to regret doing that. <laughs> it's kind of a waste of a damage phase. Though if I do survive this, I can probably just wait for a bit and do it again. There we go. Okay. Okay, please, use the glaive, please. Okay, 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 okay. I'm just found a new hatred of thrall. This is not really not enjoyable to watch, but I'm just suddenly getting a, a rampant rage for thrall right now. The funnel web. Nice, cool. Don't care. How can she be this strong? Okay, where is it? Stop running away. Okay. Come on.
Okay. Get one last shot in. And then I'm out of here. Or not, because uh -huh. this is just not enjoyable to watch. This is just not enjoyable to watch or do right now. How is she this hard? It's just the amount of enemies and just trying to kill her. Just, uh... right, I've got st I still have here for the Fred thing. Well, I may as well just capitalize on that a little bit. <laughs> Focus on those wizards. Okay. Please kill. Okay. Okay, I hate storm trance. I hate storm trance. I hate storm trance. <laughs> this is impossible to get a damage phase and then survive. Okay, well, I'd appreciate if I don't have to try and kill myself in the process. Okay. I would appreciate if I could actually see what I was doing. <laughs> okay. Okay, I'm gonna kill myself in the game, I mean. But I didn't like that run, so This is not enjoyable to watch. <laughs> it's not enjoyable to do. Okay. Please stop, all of you. Please stop. Okay, please stop running away. 
Oh, now it's the Thrall. Now it's the Thrall. The bloody Thrall. Okay, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm just simply dead. Okay, there. The Thrall are dead. I might actually somehow get to a second phase. If that can happen, I think I've got it. If that doesn't happen, then I'm not really surprised. <sighs> okay. Why is Saffron so close to this one? Okay, there we go. Okay. This is not going to do too well though without my super, so... What was in front of me? What was in front of me? Most of these are going to be cut out because it's just not enjoyable to watch or play. I'm going to turn to fucking Smeagol after this. Okay. What do you think I'm doing, Ghost? Just doing uh, lap dances around? No. Poking around here that I can uh, please get destroyed because I don't want them peeking at my arsehole when I'm actually doing the fight. is actually a really good position to be in. Because I'm above her and still in her bubble. As long as she doesn't run away, which she just did. Stop running away! Um... I would have done a lot more damage there if she didn't run away, like halfway through. But I think the smart thing to do is just get some heavy and then wait until I get my super. I think that's the smart thing to do. this curse for me, please. I believe that was alive. Probably do this with my glaive, but I really want to have some heavy, please. This is where heavy ammo synthesis would come in handy.
Okay, now I wait for my goddamn super. Okay. Is there any enemies here which can give me heavy, or is it just the two wizards? Or the two wizards? It would be the one wizard and Zafir. It looks like I'm going to have to do this with my glaive and grenades and all that. Alright. Unless this guy gives me uh, heavy ammo, which would be great, but I don't think will be the case, unfortunately. This is probably my best chance at actually getting it done as well. Is if I actually wait for my super, because then at least I have a bubble to survive in, if anything gets too bad. Okay, come on, come on. Feel trapped, feel trapped. Come on, hurry up, super. Come on. It's okay, it moves fast when I want, don't want it to, but then when it want it to, it just doesn't. It's just the light storm my life right there. Okay, come on. So close, come on. I hope I make it with this time as well, because if I don't, then I've just waited all this time for nothing. Where's the wizard? Okay. Stop running away. Okay, that's actually doing a lot of damage. Come on. Come on. Yes! 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 And she's now in the same position as she died. Ghost. What's the light? Do what's the trouble doing? I overattracted her ghost. No. Where did your ghost go? Guardian, I just got the message. The Traveler is back in the last city. Is it done? Is Salvathun... She's dead. But her ghost got away. Good enough. Hold your position. The Hidden are coming to secure the remains. Good work, Okay. Garth. You did the right thing. Now what? Now, we prepare for the witness and stop the next collapse. Okay, okay, good to know. So the Traveler took the ghost? Interesting. Oh, hello. Hello. 
Oh, whoa. Well, that's a new synergy. Who is the We have seen in her. What? Holy crap. Do not be afraid. Holy moly. Holds the key. This time there is no escape. That is oddly stereotypical alien, but also haunting. Right, so Safoon is dead, but not permanently dead. Okay. And now I'm getting taken somewhere. Where I'm getting taken to, I don't exactly know. Okay, I'm getting taken to the Enclave then. Okay. Well, let's just say. You've no doubt heard the stories. Where evil is vanquished and the sky opens, shining peace down on humanity. Huh. Savathun is dead. And yet again, I've seen no such signs. Huh. Instead, Imaru lives. Amaru. Plotting his return while the Scorn and the Hive struggle for supremacy over the throne world. Who's Amaru? And somewhere among the stars, this witness toys with us, preparing to finish what it started long ago. I keep reminding myself that somehow we evaded extinction once before. I have to believe we can do it again. Mm. Even Mara Saab, Queen of the Awoken, believes that. Which is why she's here, requesting you. What? Reluctant as I may be to pair you with one so unpredictable, we need the support now more than ever. Okay. Go. Aid the Queen. She may prove to be our most valuable ally yet in the war to come. Okay. Okay. So meet. Okay, so continue with the story. So we're solve, okay. And investigate clues in the wellspring. Okay, put your siphon. Okay. Come back safe. Right. Well, let's have a look at this post box here. Okay, there. Let's have a look. Evidence board. Um, okay, report. Con uh, okay, phone world weapon. Okay. I'll do that next time. But what's going on down here is what I'm worried about. I'm not worried about more concerned about. Okay, we're going further. Right. Approach Dying Worm. Is this for Mara's part of the quest? I believe that is. But I saw something to do with a relic, so I'm going to go back to the relic. 
Is it here? No. Here. Okay, so shape. Uh, it's a machine gun. There we go. Shape. Right. Um, yeah. Empty care list. Can't put that in yet. And then, shape weapon. So, we've got the first exilic of this DLC the SMG. Which I. Hmm. Let's have a look at it anyway. Interesting. I'm going to end this part here. If you'd like to hit that one swipe, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye for now. Bye.